Welcome back to the winner's enclosure. The first of eight out at the big tee for today, and it goes the way of the first timer, number 12, Var and away, a son of Var, out of a parade leader, Mayor Angel Witch, Mike DeCock, teaming up with Mr. Shang, and of course, a vast 15 stud. He was a 275,000 rand purchase, and Randall Simons had uh, the pleasure of stepping aboard this individual for today, Randy. Congratulations, because uh, a few hundred meters out, I couldn't even see those silks, just could hear Nico calling them home, but uh, when they flashed home, came on with purpose. Yeah, uh, I think he's still a big baby. This was, um, he's going to come on a lot. Well done to Mr. Chang, uh, Mr. DeCock, the whole team. Thank you. Yeah, uh, look, when I came to him down, you could feel. He was, he's got a massive action and he had his ears pricked the whole way. You can feel he'll needs further. I think what helped one won the gates race today was quick out the gates and um, I let him use his pace. They passed me at about the, uh, 900, but I knew when I asked him, when I get after him, he will, he will quicken up. And he won a good race today. Absolutely smashing because it uh, wasn't an easy race because there were a few horses and had some very, very nice forms. So the fact that he came through with no experience to beat him is a win full of merit. Now, Ram, before you leave us, in the fifth race, you got a horse called Ragoon. He must be a lot better than his last run. Yeah, as you said, also, though, um, it's not easy coming here a first time or taking on uh, race horses, experienced horses, and they do have form, you know, they, they run good races. Like he showed them, he showed them he's, um, he's a nice up and coming horse, and well done. Um, Ragoon has a massive chance. Um, it is a small field, but tough field. Um, we don't know Mr. De Cox has Apache 2, um, Mutawakal in the race, or Mutawakal. I don't know how, how good they are, but we, we didn't, we're in there with a the shot. Well done. Keep it up. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much to winning jockey Randall Simons. Let's get uh, Matthew De Cox into the house. You must be very, very impressed with this uh, victory, Matt. Now, we know you've got uh, a number of very, very smart first-timers um, at home. Have you tried him out with anything? Yeah, he has impressed us at home. Um, obviously, we were confident in his ability today, but his mother won over 2,000, and he's quite a laid-back character, so a lot had to depend on how green he was going to be, but I think there's a lot of scope for improvement, which is, which is really impressive. Matt said he went down to the post really nicely, really sensible, and uh, when he got out the gates, that's what probably won him the race. Yeah, he's, he seems very professional at home, and it showed today. I think he's got a good mind on him, and, and hopefully he can go on from here. Wonderful. Now you've got uh, not many runners coming up later on. You've got another first time in race number three. What's called Maloka in the ideal world? Um, she's been showing decent work, signs of greenness. Um, it doesn't look like the strongest of fields, barring one or two. So I think she must have a place chance, but she's got a lot of room for improvement after today. And then in race number five, we've got Apache 2, who uh, seems like quite a gutsy sort and has a nice turn of foot. He does. He's very gutsy. Um, you know, we were angling to go a bit further than a mile, but unfortunately, draws dictated to where we ran. Um, but he's in good form. Obviously, Mr. Terry's horse looks like an impressive horse and could be ahead of the handicapper. So I think they're two nice young horses, and I think it'll be a good race. Thank you very much. Thank you. And I just want to thank you, thank uh, Mr. Zhang and, and Eric. Uh, we really appreciate having them in the yard. Nice to have some support from them, and it looks like they've bought a nice horse. So congratulations. Wonderful. My pleasure. Thank you very much to Matthew DeCock, and that's going to be number 12, Var and Away, the son of Var coming through for Randall Simons, Mike DeCock, Mr. Zhang, and Var Spentin. Start back in second, you'll find the eight horse, which is going to be Roy Tom. Third place will go to the five, informative, head of back in fourth, number three, Al Patron. That's how they cross the line in race number one, the first leg of the bipod.